happier, Fedor or his entourage. Brett Rogers, like so many in the past, wondering what happened. Let's take another look. Rogers had the right plan. He was working the game, but into that punch and it connected right on the chin of Rogers. Jumped on him and finished him up. This is why he is so dangerous. One punch, the entire fight can change. And that stand-up was all about range and timing. And we said that Rogers had to punch first. He had to punch first. He waited for a second there. He waited one second. Fedor came over the top, clipped him, and it jumped right on him for the finish. Final look at it. This is going to show you where it hits. Right on his chin. Here comes the punch. It's too late. Clean shot. Fedor was literally jumping into the punch. Millionenko's eighth win via form of knockout. The last being Andre Orlovsky. Power and precision of this man is extraordinary.
Here once again is Jimmy Lennon Jr. with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, we have the time. One minute, 48 seconds in round number two. A referee in charge, Big John McCarthy, stops the contest due to strikes. He is the winner by way of spectacular TKO, the one and only Fedor Emelianenko. Fedor, first of all, congratulations to Brett Rogers for fighting a tough fight. I think uh, he deserves a hand uh, here in Chicago. Brett Rogers doing a nice job challenging the best fighter in the world. First of all, how difficult was this for you, especially after the first round when you received the cut? Федор, ну, во-первых, мы поздравляем вас с этой прекрасной победой, то, что вы бросили вызов Бретту Роджерсу в его родном городе. Как это, как вы себя чувствовали во время... During the first round. Как вы себя чувствовали во время первого раунда? Хорошо, спасибо большое, хорошо себя чувствовал, слава Богу. I felt myself really good, thank you very much for asking. Felt really good, thanks God. What was the key for you fighting a man that was taller than you, fighting a man that was heavier than you with a longer reach? Какой был ключ к победе над бойцом, который выше вас и который тяжелее вас? The main thing is not to be nervous, to take some time during the first round to learn a little bit the manners of opponent, and then to look for some weak place and to use it. What did you see, Fedor, after that first round to allow you to go out and knock out Brett Rogers? What did you see in the first, after the first round to allow him to knock Brett Rogers out in the second round? Что вы заметили такого, Федор, Федор, во время первого раунда в Роджерсе, что позволило вам в дальнейшем его нокаутировать? Uh, ну, Брэд, безусловно, замечательный боец. Но я посмотрел на его передвижение ног и uh, постарался подловить на его движение. Как он, well, на, на его реакции. Well, no doubt, Брэд is a great fighter. But I watched a little bit his legs play, and I found some moment and found the weak space in that leg play. Exciting fight. Do you foresee a rematch with Brett Rogers? Очень потрясающий захватывающий бой. Видите ли вы в будущем бой реванш с Бреттом Роджерсом? Если Брэд захочет, конечно, почему нет? Большое ему спасибо за этот бой. If Brett will, if Brett would like to have such a rematch, why not? Thank you, thank you very much. Fedor Emelianenko, congratulations. Я бы, я бы хотел всех, я бы хотел всех поблагодарить за поддержку, за то, что вы болели за меня. Сейчас в это время в России, в моей любимой стране, в моей родине. Молились за меня миллионы православных моих соотечественников, а это победа их не моя. I'm very thankful to all of you, to those who came here to support me, to those who supported me in my country. Right now there are a lot of people in Russia, Russian Orthodox people who are praying for us, and that's not only that's not my victory, that's our mutual victory thank you very much Fedor thank you thank you thank you Brett Rogers we'd like to talk to you Brett you came into this fight undefeated uh, you faced the best fighter not only pound for pound in the world but some consider the greatest fighter in the history of this sport your reaction to losing for the first time the way you did I hate it I'm coming back stronger you see what I'm saying this is I mean ah. I'm so, I'm so, I'm so, I'm so heated, man. I can't even put it to words, the words that I want to put it to. He wants to rematch me, I, I, so I'll, tell, I'll put it to you like this. I will gladly take that rematch. 
But on this day, Brett, on this day, on this day, you lost to one of the best fighters in the world. Hold on. All right, all right. Let's talk about it. Okay. You were knocked out in the second round. It's the first time you've touched the canvas. What happened? What did you see uh, losing this fight? What did I see was me doubting myself. Uh, uh, you know, I, I doubted myself a little bit. Uh, I should I should have threw more. I should have threw my hands a little, a lot more, a lot more. And that's the only reason I failed today, man. If I wouldn't, if I wouldn't have did that piece, I'ma come back and please believe I'ma throw him. Please believe him. Okay, Brett Rogers, thank you very much. Fedor Amelia.